Yo, what's up guys, um, Billy PC here, back with another video. Now today I'm going to show you how to do the attachment glitch in MW3 because a lot of people are confused as to how this works. By the way, you can do you can do this with like these variants that have, these have like, uh, you know, like three attachments. You can actually make that into five and then you can convert it so you get the plus two attachments as well. There is a way to do that, but um, it's been a while since I've tried it, but I'll try it for the uh, furnace. This is for the uh, Martos 556. So I'm going to use the furnace. Now this is what you do. You go to Gunsmith. Now what you do is take off uh, one attachment. You put on another. Now this part's very important. Uh, for me, obviously I'll put on this, but the second attachment you want to remove. This is um, this is my method that I found out. Uh, first one you take off one of the attachments. Next you take off the optic. If it does not have an optic full of variant, you just take off the one attachment one by one and you just do the glitch. So for this, I'll put on this because it has fast ABS speed. And then you take off the mag and then you put on an under barrel. For me, I'll just use the uh, Dr. Six hand spot. And then these two you take off, so you're on three out of five. And then you put on a attachment. So I'll put on Quartz Classic, just a random one that no one uses. See how it says four out of five. Now you press options. You save it, and now you go back to this. Now I'll put on the I'll put on the Jack Bordeaux, as you can see. That have the original version, of course. Uh, yeah, it shows up as four. So let me put on that model again. Now what you do is, uh, this is what I do. I go to edit. I back out. Go to edit. Go to the weapon. Go over to the blueprint I just saved. Delete it. Make sure you delete that. That's this is uh, my way of doing it. You go back in, you go to Gunsmith, and as you can see, now it has the old version. And then you go to this, you save it, and then you rename, and then it's done. <laughs> that's that's how you do it. That's the new way of doing it. And then you can add camos, you can add um, decals and all that to it. You can add all these different things in there as well. But I'll, I'll have my signature one uh, real quick, just to show this all, all work in the game. Um, where is it? There you go. That camos d d doesn't really matter what camo you put on. I just put on this. <laughs> but yeah, there you go. It's done. And again, you can just up update the mod. And look, see, it says close quarters. But I did press on Jack Balls, right? so it will work. And then I'll show you in the game in just a moment. Okay, one sec. I'm just loading into a custom games just because it's easier for me to do. And that, so that way I can just show you how this works without being, you know, like wrecked over another by all these hackers in the game. Right, I'm gonna go over to the weapon. This is the base version. Whoops. Now, yeah, let me show you this real quick. The furnace, as you can see, it has all this. You know, it has the 50 round drum. Now, this is the glitch. Now, just to show. For the setup, I'll pick this. No magazine, not a single mag, no 50 round mag. Now, if I quit, as you can see, I have 50, but I shouldn't. Let me check again. Nope, see, this class is equipped with a tick. I'll go back to this again. I have all these, I have the barrel, I have this, I have all these different stuff, but there is no 50 round mag equipped. But for some reason, when I go to it, it's clearly equipped. And yeah, there you go. Yeah, I didn't see him. Uh, but yeah, there you go, guys. That's how you do it. And yeah, you can see these blueprints through all this different stuff. And then, and then that, this is a pistol with it as well, with my signature, um, my signature one as well. Yeah, it's weird than that how this weapon works. But yeah, um, yeah, there you go, guys. That's how you do it. And that, hopefully, this will uh, help you people in the game. And if you enjoyed this video, if it helped you out, then please share with your friends, family, your pet dog, food, and And yeah, uh, guys, I guess take care and peace. And yeah, guys, share this with everyone as well. So see ya. Bye.